I'm going to show you how to uh, download and install a library in Arduino. Uh, the last set of videos I showed you how to write a library and what I've done is I've taken that library and I've actually, you can see it, I, I uh, dragged it over to my desktop and I zipped it up just by, for those of you who don't know, you can send to compressed file with Windows and you can make a zip easy that way. And I uploaded it to uh, a website that I have and I'm going to pop that up. Um, I'm going to find a better place for it, but this is just a demonstration how to, how to do it. Uh, if you find one out there, which are plenty of them, um, what you have to do is you have to download the zip, which I'm going to click on, and lo and behold, it pops up right there. Now, there's a couple ways to do this. Uh, oddly, um, the old the Arduino. Let me open it up here. Um, it has this function up here where you can import a library and add to library. Uh, before my Windows 8 machine, this worked really nice, and it popped up down here in a special section. Um, it hasn't been doing that uh, as of late, and I don't know why, but one guaranteed way to make sure your library goes is to uh, simply uh, just go ahead and download it. And if, if your computer's like mine, this is all set up as default, it should pop up in the uh, downloads section here. So it popped up right here, just took the whole thing in. And then it's nothing more than simply opening up the directory where you have your Arduino. And if you have a doubt about that, you can always right click on the Arduino icon and you can go to properties. And from there, you can see that in this case, it's in program files x86 Arduino, Arduino.exe. Uh, so we know it's in this, this directory here. So I'm going to go to the C. I'm going to go to program files x86. I'm going to go to Arduino. And here's my libraries. And if I literally just copy this, um, copy this over to libraries, copy it or move it, say continue it pops up close that close that we'll minimize that let's open up Arduino and we'll do a file new and we'll make sure it's there and if I go to sketch import a library and lo and behold there it is okay again I don't know why this add library in my case doesn't put it down here anymore um, but manually dragging it into the library's directory seems to always work. Uh, so that is it, and I will see you again soon.